I just want to do a quick video to show you how to open the lift gate on a 2005 Sequoia after this mechanism has failed and it's left in the lock position which means that even though you replace the handle that's on the outside right in there it's still not gonna open so I saw videos where they show a guy cutting this part right here from the inside of the vehicle which to do that you have to rip this weatherproofing and it seems like a lot more work than it has to be so what I was able to do is this part here actually goes right in there so I won't show you how to remove the panel from the back door because there's videos that already show you how to do that but right in there it's kind of dark here but right behind this motor underneath there is where you will find this assembly right here with the cable that goes attached to the handle but anyhow in there you will notice that there is the the assembly in there actually includes this little motor here which in my case if you notice right there the little piece that locks it and unlocks it broke off and it looks like like this so this little part broke off from from here so this this is the part that once you push the button on the controller this should slide up and down like that which activates the mechanism that allows you to be able to open it so in my case that thing broke off so it was left in the locked position so what you need to do is while this parts connected to the tailgate you're gonna have to actually try to remove the bolts from here. Let's see if I can do this. And sorry, it's dark, too much movement, but anyhow, I'm trying to do this by myself. Um, you're gonna have to remove bolts basically here. Here, actually, there's some. 10 millimeter nuts that go there there's another one down here and another one right there so once you remove those you should be able to push this backwards which will give you room to put your hand in there and try to reach to where this part is and what you're gonna want to do is notice this thing has two screws right there those little screws you're gonna have to somehow reach behind because when when that part is installed the way you're gonna find it is it's gonna be inside of there like this which means when you reach behind with your hand you're gonna have to feel here for two screws and you're just gonna have to feel for them but just to show you where they are, see, there's two of them. One right here and one right here. So once you reach behind and, and loosen these up, I have actually just ended up pulling one of these guys out. And with my own hands, I was able to reach behind and loosen these. Once you take these off, this whole plastic housing, when you um, also disconnect these, disconnect this wire and the one that goes in here 
to disconnect these basically on this one you just push um, the part that goes in actually you push on it and it allows it to pop off and also the one that goes in here basically which are these cables right here these right here so it just pushes you push in here and this one pops off and this one you push here and pull out pull, pulls right out once you push here so once you disconnect those you're gonna be able to end up with the part that looks like this with the screws already out this whole plastic piece you just force it out and it should slide right right off so once you do that then this will still be attached to the tailgate so what you're going to want to do is with this housing off you're going to actually be able to reach in there Let's see if I can show you oh, I already put the screws on but anyhow there is it's going to be like this like this when you find it so when this is off you're actually just going to be able to reach in with assuming this plastic is off you're just going to actually reach with your finger and you're going to push the the piece that should allow for the the locking mechanism to open so you don't you don't have to take it you don't have to take this off or you don't have to cut it you don't have to you don't have to remove this all you have to do is once you pull this plastic piece back up um, pull it off you're going to be able to find the mechanism that's actually right behind here and you're going to be able to just put your hand in there and push it once you push it that way that's going to allow for this to open so i was able to just do that with my finger with very little force you you can't miss it you just basically you're gonna find it like this so this is off you already took the screws from back here and then you're just gonna put your hand in there and push the mechanism over which if it's basically this since this is missing you're just gonna have to push the metal piece it's a metal piece you push it with your hands and once you push it open you're gonna be able to just pull on this cable here and that's gonna allow that thing to open so anyhow I hope this helps sorry I couldn't remove this to show you what that looks like but um, you'll be able to see it once you remove these screws from behind pull this off and this will still be attached to the tailgate right here with three bolts which you won't be able to reach them until it's open but once you push that mechanism um, then it, it's going to be able to open and then you, you can just go underneath and remove the bolts that look like this the ones that attach it to to here those three bolts once you do that then it'll come right off. Alright, well, hope it helps. Thanks.